Yes, guys, we are finally back again for another one, another reaction on this BRBP TV, guys. Hopefully, I'll be dropping two today on this uh, channel as well as the Mr. Lix reaction, guys. The links will be in the first comment in the comment box below, guys. So definitely look out for that right there. And with that said, guys, welcome to each and every one of you guys, brothers and sisters. And of course, today is the day, the match day, brothers and sisters. I actually made a mistake yesterday stating that it was the 24th. Uh, but a number of persons, big up to the Mr. Lix family, who definitely corrected me and say, Mr. Lix is the 23rd. And you guys are definitely right. But of course, we're going to get into that, 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 uh, a snippet of that vibrations right there. But before we get into that, guys, we must bring on Dice, man. Dice, take it away! Ba -ba 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 -ba. I don't know. I don't know what was that, brothers and sisters. I was trying to do boom ba boom beat. I, I, anyways, let's go. Yeah, man. Yes, man. If you believe in fairness and justice, I do. Do you? If you believe in collective growth, I do. It's not for some people. But for everybody and not the lazy, you know, Mark you. Some of us believe it's collective growth, but we don't want to do nothing. No man, stop your dirty ways. That's not for you. Stop your dirty ways so it can become you. Brothers and sisters. Collective, don't be lazy. Of course, collective is for everybody, regardless of those who don't want to and those who want to. But I think it'd be beneficial if everybody was, you know, not lazy. And just waiting for handouts, brothers and sisters. If you want to go forward collectively. Let us make the move. If you support the true reason for law and order. Yes, brothers and sisters, we know law and order has gone out of the window. And then we expect some sort of justice to be had when things happen. Especially when it's against the citizens of the Commonwealth of Dominica. Brothers and sisters, it's vital that the justice system remains what? Justified by truth, brothers and sisters, and by law. Of course, the law must be justified by the truth, you know. But if the law, you know, you get my point, brothers and sisters. So we must always want what? Justice. If you believe in honor and the best way to do things. Yes, brothers and sisters. What is the best way for us to move forward? Is it, oh, let's sell passports and then we don't know what happened to the money. We heard that 10 million, bi <laughs> what million, what, what, what million I seen, you know. Ten billion dollars, brothers and sisters, has gone missing. Only two point something billion dollars came to Dominica since 2016. Are you understand what I'm saying there? And we wonder why things are not happening, why factories are not being set up and these kind of things there. Because ten billion dollars is out there, brothers and sisters. Good doing God knows what. From since 2016 to 2020. Doing God knows what, you know, but, um, you know, the people just have to stay quiet about this, brothers and sisters. It's time to make a change and move forward. We can't just be stagnant there and there's things happening to us. We wonder, but what's going on now, boy? Why things not going forward in Dominica? Why can't I get a raise in my salary? Well, that is exactly why. Because the monies have been put outside there for individuals out there to do whatever they want. Build all sorts of things for themselves. While they're giving the dregs to Dominica. And we wonder why things are not happening. Guys, it's not some people you're not know, happening to. They're happening to everybody. Not some people, everybody, brothers and sisters. Anyways, let me continue. Let us match. Let us match, brothers and sisters. Today, it has already started. For Dominica. Yes, man. Let us match for us. Us for us. Us for us. Not us for them and them for them. No, us for everybody is us. U.S. You in, there's a U in us, you know. There's also a S, so there's many U's out there. Us, brothers and sisters. I didn't know where I was going with that, but it makes sense. You, 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 you. Many U's make us, brothers and sisters. Ah, hallelujah. Yes, sir. This Wednesday, 23rd of August, 2023. 1 p.m. Today, 1 p.m. It has already started. They're already marching. We'll get to it in a moment. From the Portersville Savannah, through the streets of the capital, mm. to a national public meeting on the Roseau Riverbank. So, brothers and sisters, if you were not able to make it to the, the march, you can always make it to the meeting on the riverbank. Roseau Riverbank, brothers and sisters. Okay? 
I just had to put that out there. If you were not able, I have to work, alas. I have to work. I want to be there, you know, but I have to work. But you can always make it for the meeting, brothers and sisters. A match for you who is present. For us, the many yous out there. The us is. That don't make any sense. But the use, brothers and sisters, the use. A match for your children's future. <laughs> a match for the other generations to come. That, that not even for our generation, oh, brothers and sisters. I say not like it's so old. <laughs> brothers and sisters, that, that, that not even for us no, again. Because we then have to go through the grind to create something. If surplus has started flowing into Dominica. When the regime, the regime that has literally been kept keeping Dominica down. I've been hearing individuals saying, Melissa not from Dominica. She's a thing. A, a scary not from Dominica. They say he French. Um, Anthony Hayden not from Dominica. So you have a set of people in the top who are seemingly doing things for themselves. And they are not doing things for the country because they are not from the country that they seem to be governing. Huh. Why would you do something if you so care about your country? I mean, look at it, brothers and sisters. Scared make his children born overseas. He's the prime minister of a country wanting to do better for the people. But instead, he realized, you know what? Me having my children born in the country that I am governing, the head governor in, uh, that, was, that, that doesn't seem to be sitting with me right. Best I make my children born in another country where things will be better for them, even though I am the prime minister who is supposed to make things better, not just for my little ones, but for the country by extension. That is not happening, brothers and sisters. The prime minister, they're building all sorts of mansions. The people in government are building more mansions and they are supposed to be the servants of the people. And you mean to tell me you're going to stay quiet? You're going to stay quiet. Okay. Um. Now we have a steam property. Fruits of our misplaced loyalty. Hmm. Guys, what is your loyalty towards? What exactly? That's a good misplaced loyalty. What is your loyalty towards? Is it to the party or is it to country? I think we need to step aside of this partisan thing. Like people always say, it's not a politics. Everything is politics, brothers and sisters. But it's partisan that is dividing the country, not politics. Politics affect every single one. The policies that are put in place by our leaders, we so we we supposed to actually get the mandate from the very people themselves, which apparently doesn't seem to be happening in Dominica. Look at the electoral reform, and it's interesting. We're gonna be talking about electoral reform in the next reaction on this here BRBP TV channel, brothers and sisters, because I realize it seems like there's a lot of people who came to this session. Because there are people benefiting from the government who come to make it seem as if they don't want certain things in positions. Brothers and sisters, is not what the people want. Generally speaking, is what they want or what they're telling the benefactors what they want to tell so they can come in the public, you know? Come in the public and have a set of them. We'll react to that, man. Tune in. Well, let's continue. No, we must enact to country. Yes, and everybody. Everybody. Beginning with me. Beginning with me. Yes, man. So, are you, are you going to be... Does it begin with you? Does it begin with you, brothers and sisters? Or are you going to say, my mother was a laborite. My grandfather was a papi. I when papi used to talk about burning the ganja, Smith. Brothers and sisters, what exactly are we? Are we loyal to party? Or are we loyal to the economy and see if the economy is going forward or not? If it's not going forward, whoever is the leader of that, I don't care if it's UWP, I don't care if it's party, I don't, uh, right now it's the labor right. Brothers and sisters, they need to come out there. Because they are killing the economy of Dominica. While they come in and complain and say, hey guys, things are bad everywhere. And then you're watching the lifestyles of them building mega mansions for themselves. While also trying to manipulate the books so that they can get things cheaper. It's interesting how things work in. And people know this is happening. And people realize, hey, I am getting an apartment. Thank God for an apartment. I get to apartment. You cannot pass on the apartment for nobody business for your children to benefit from it. You can't say, let me put my, my you know, things are hard. The economy doing well. Let me put my house up for, 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 for my little one to get a fighting chance to go overseas. Because the very prime ministers allow these children to go and born overseas. So that says a lot 
about the prime minister who is in charge of a country that says insurmountable amount. That's the word now. An insurmountable amount, brothers and sisters. If I hopefully I say correct, the word does pop in my head. Anyways, brothers and sisters, you get the point. Let's continue. So come out, teachers, everybody, nurses, doctors. Everybody's supposed to come out. Teachers complain about the salaries. It means I mean I need a little nurses complain about salaries and they need in and proper facilities. They're saying these things. Patients are dying. I heard Lennox the, um, yesterday stating the very same sentiment. How on earth there are a lot of persons that could have been alive today if we had proper medical attention. Yet still McIntyre come on stage and tell the public, oh, we have a hospital that can be compared to first world countries. When we're doing worse than we was 20 years ago. Man used to leave overseas and come to Dominica for operation. We, I... That's how, when I learned that, I learned that in Le Saints, in Guadeloupe. Le Saints, I was brothers and sisters. Man meeting us and he talking to, hey, you came from Dominica, yeah, were you probably in the wrong place. Hey, I was Dominica, why were you in Dominica? How long ago? 30 plus years ago, you say something. He came to Dominica for an operation. And when I found this out, brothers and sisters, I did a little more, I started doing a little more digging. And I found that a number of persons who were overseas who actually came to Dominica for medical attention. And not just medical attention. Man right now going overseas to do shopping. Brothers and sisters, man from overseas used to come to Dominica to shop with. Where you hear that? <laughs> Where you hear that? Man overseas, we. Guadeloupe and all the places used to come to Dominica to shop. I did the history of, of, of Dominica um um yesterday on mr Lick's reaction guys you need to check that reaction out and it gives this sentiment as to why that was and that was way back in the day leading up to now brothers and sisters is don't we going we don't we going while the leaders them you seen them being have all two hundred and fifty thousand dollar vehicles they're giving that to their people and not their people huh? they're giving that to the 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 the, the, the i was going to say the elites there's a word that I learned. It's not deletes. The people who suck in the country dry. I forget it. I wanted to use it today. But I forget it, brothers and sisters. But the whole point is, brothers and sisters, they give their people all sorts of things. All sorts of things. The blood suckers. They give them all sorts of things. And they come in and tell the people things are hard. While the people paying taxes to feed the very government officials who are doing things that are not accounted for. And then they're getting all sorts of gifts from foreign entities, brothers and sisters. That is something else, we. That is something else, we boy. But hey, let's continue. Lawyers, civil servants, farmers, Everybody. tradesmen, truckers. All of all you. Guys, there have never been. Which is the industry in Dominica that has not protested? Which is the industry? Farmers protest, truckers protest, teachers, nurses, policemen protest. Guys, which is the industry that people have not protested yet in Dominica? Locals have protest. Only the, the gravians, the gra what do you call them? The gravians? The vagrants, I say the gravians. The vagrants, the vagrants protest already. Now I know they was protesting in St. Lucia. I know they protest in Dominica yet. Maybe... Maybe they checking everybody coming like them. What are they? What are they protesting for? You know, <laughs> everybody coming like me. What are they protesting for? So, but everybody needs to come together, guys, because the economy affects everybody. Just like the people in labor rights are saying, "Oh, dumb leg, Dominica, get, get back, dumb leg." Oh, good thing and high high price hit the people because they were saying they're not going to pay no more bill. <laughs> hey, are you going to not pay no more bill and you pay the highest? Got a price for electricity you have ever paid in your life before. All you know, all you know. <laughs> unemployed, self employed. Boy, the unemployment rate is it rising. Unemployment rate is rising. When you self employed, alas, I know a number of businesses before I left. Um, I'm, I'm D. I know a number of businesses that spoke about that very same senti sentiment to me. There was one in particular where I always tend to go and get something. And she was telling me, boy, Mr. Legs, but let me tell you something now. If it wasn't for that shop, I don't know where. But at least this shop is meeting my daily needs. There's nothing much for me to save. So I, I in, in probing her and whatnot, I ask her, well, you know, in sentimental, you know, how I was already when I trying to get answers from people. <laughs> um, so I asked her a leading question and she gave me the indication 
That is about five to ten dollars that she saved the previous month. I say, well, at least you're getting to save something in this economy that has been created by the government. But you too need to go out there and start demanding that the government leaves because they are the ones who taking out everything from you. Back in the day, she was telling me she was a striving business. But 10, 15 years ago, she told me she was a striving business. Now, if she get to save 5 to $10, she happy. Ha ha, you get to save 5 at least she meeting her obligations, paying electricity and whatnot with the rising costs, brothers and sisters. And at least she get to save five to ten dollars. Ah. And people that happening to people, and you mean to tell me you're not going to match? You're not going to be a part of this thing? To say that I rally with the people? All of all you online. We'll get to her in a while. Private sector. Policeman. Everybody. Fireman. Oh. Rasta man. Rasta. Rasta man was protesting to <laughs> Rasta was protesting too. Young and uh. old. No, we very asi situation fatidic. Hmm. Make ready and nous sorti. Nous ne pour so. Make ready gasa today. The mama Dominic. Not perfect, just better. You don't need to make a perfect Dominic brothers and sisters. You just need to be striving for betterment. A number of persons say, well, that is what it have. Brothers and sisters, you don't need to look for perfection for yourself. Just better mentally. Better mentally. You mean to tell me I have to be pleading if all you for better men for you? <laughs> Jano! Brothers and sisters, let's get to the pro um, um, the protest, the walk. So this is the walk in Rosa, brothers and sisters. 908 of all you online. 908 of all you online. Why 908 of all you not there? Huh? All you paying all this solidarity. By the way, this is MO News. You can get more on MO News right there, brothers and sisters. But 908 of all you are online watching the few hundred people that there. I supposed to be seeing 30 to 40,000 people here. Some of all you just. Ay, ay, ay. Boy. <laughs> There's a good amount of people, but I, I'm expecting to see thousands of people there. Ha! Loyalty to party. Brothers and sisters, loyalty to party is not politics. Politics allows you to have loyalty to party, but partisan is not politics, brothers and sisters. You support your political party. That is an allowance from the policies of politics. Loyalty to party is a very dangerous thing. You know why? Because when your party is doing wrong, I will never forget that individual I was messaging. He's a labor right. He benefits from the government and everything. I understand his sentiment right there. But he's telling me they finally have a chance. He knows his party is terrible. He knows this. But he, the, the, the previous election, I think it's 2019, he said they finally have a chance to rectify the wrongs that they have done. Today, <laughs> you know how much things Dominica has lost? You know how much things Dominica has lost as a result of the very government that this man was saying, finally in 2019, they finally have a chance to rectify their wrongs again. Was it 2019 or the previous one? I think it's the previous one. But so much elections happening, brothers and sisters, you just get confused. We're looking at another one in 2022. <laughs> Let me bring that back. Well, you didn't hear that. Loyalty to party is the road to poverty. It should be loyalty to country. Brothers and sisters, if you are loyalty to country, what is happening as a result of these people that we put in positions or bribe, bribe them way into positions 
Don't you think that Dominica would have been better if our loyalty was to country and not party? Or you see the country going down, but instead it was my party, I support my party. Really? Really? My guy, come on. Nope. But the people at the top are the ones pushing division. That's what they do. They feed their flock. They give them the breadcrumbs, probably the healthier breadcrumbs. They come in positions to say certain things because they are benefiting from it. They're getting monies from it. So obviously, if they are benefiting and the people want to stand up, of course, they will push their agendas. Brothers and sisters, me talking about these things, I have no, absolutely no benefit at all. The only benefit I have, brothers and sisters, is seeing people doing well so they will stop come and ask me for things. That is my, that's my benefit to <laughs> The among the people are just beg and say, and not just beg you, they're begging your friends too. I have friends that people just beg who overseas now. They begging my friends overseas for things and say, but Miss Licks, what happened to Dominicans, boy? What happened to Dominicans? Always begging me for something. And some of them will pretend that he's your friend and then later on, they come to beg you for stuff. So you don't think if our loyalty was to country, things would have been better, brothers and sisters? Huh? A little think so? I think so. We. Eh? <laughs> I could be wrong. Eh? Let me know if I'm wrong. Everything should be towards the country, guys. Everything. People used to tell me about the tales of back in the days, and I used to tell people the tales of back in the Pika days, man. Where well, man used to come and take vacation in Picard. <laughs> man leaving Roseau to come and take vacation weekend in Picard. I have to tell you how Picard was, brothers. Not what I talking about, you know. Picard I talking about. Go and spend some time in the hotels and, you know, in different places, man. Go to the beach, you know. Take a visit to Posse. From time to time, purple turkle. <laughs> According to one of the individuals, purple turkle. Yes, man. Right now, okay. We start from scratch again, brothers and sisters, as, as a result of what I was I was told to be CBI. You know, CBI brought the medical hospital, and of course, they brought in a number of individuals to Dominica to try to help the industry. All right. Anyways, brothers and sisters, we have Mister Steels from Steels Kitchen. Living in New York. Dominica, Dominica, don't forget Nature Eye. This is the flag we're representing. Dominica, don't forget to march for the future of Dominica. For the future of Dominica, that there Boy, that is something else, we got, sir. That is truly something else, we. And people allow that to happen to them, we. Brothers and sisters, everything. I saw from all the way back since I was high, in high school talking to my classmates about these things, telling them sometimes they used to love this. A lot of times you say, that's the best thing the man young he had the impulse. Is that time now? No, that's not that time. <laughs> Anyways, that was a bit later on. But, brothers and sisters, you get the point. You get the point, you know? Talking to my, my, my fellow classmates about different things and telling them certain things that will happen, and they say that's impossible. Man, today, every living thing I said came true. Everything we, every living, there was one point in time I was thinking, Boy, the people don't see that the prime minister is going to look like a king. I was literally saying that back in the days we brothers and sisters. The Prime Minister wants to make himself like a king and the people outside will be his loyal subjects. So said, so done. Ay, ay, ay. Let's make a, a change. 20 plus years is enough of the tyranny of, of lawlessness, of doing what they want. Make a change. We but they have to, I understand the sentiment. Why they have to constantly fight and put their people in positions and so forth and so forth. Why? Because they have to prevent themselves from going to jail. Yes! <laughs> they have to prevent themselves from going to jail. 
So they have to fight to for nail. Come and give you little money. Come and talk to you and whatnot. All these things so you can get your entire family to vote for them. They're not thinking about you now. They think about themselves not going to jail. That's what they're thinking of. And by right, you know you should fight to for nail to not go to jail. I understand. <laughs> I understand. But brothers and sisters, when it's evident enough and the people are suffering as a result of these people trying not to go to jail, I mean, don't you think that there should be a change? I mean, I could be wrong, but I just think it only makes sense. I am a logical thinker, brothers and sisters. So when I think of these things, I think logically about certain circumstances. And brothers and sisters, don't get me wrong, you know, I think Prime Minister Scary should, should definitely, you know, for the actions or whatever actions he has done, he should face the consequences. But I don't think he should go to jail at all. You know why? He should go and get all the monies that he has used outside there. Bring it back and go about your business. He's not deserving for the people to pay tax money to have him sit down in jail eating pigs now. No, man. Go outside. Viv, go and free up yourself. Is for you know Dominica? You say you're from French? Go France, man. He's not deserving of that. We are too much last in the Caribbean, Dominica. Let's move forward. Remember when Reggie came and said, guys, we have been last for too long. Last for too long. You guys been up there. We have been there for over 15 years. You come in and tell the people they have been last for too long. And you are the lead. What are the leaders in the country? Talking about Dominica has been last for too long. And you have been there for over 15 years blaming the opposition still. When you free guys, hey, let's blame something else. Erica, come, let's blame Erica. Maria, come, let's blame Maria. And now the Rona. So we just keep blaming everything except the individuals causing the problem. Let's do it for the future of the children, children, children to come. Ah, crimes that rise in Norway. You know that? Crimes that rise in Norway. Brothers and sisters, I think we need to stop the crimes. But the best way to stop the crimes, you know, idle hands are Satan's tools. Well, is to give the people a hammer in their hands so that they can go work. Metaphorically speaking. Well, if it's carpentry, you can do, hey, go ahead. But the idle hands, brothers and sisters, I ain't the zombie tools. People get serious. Get serious, man. Yes. Yeah. Talk to us, man. The time is up. Up on us, man. Brothers and sisters, like I said before, if you miss the walk, then there's a Roseau River Bank, 3 p.m. Obviously, it's still going on all the way now. Hopefully, I get to react to some of the vibes that I get to see. I wish I was there. Unfortunately, I was not able to be there. A number of persons have been messaging me, say, Mr. Lix, you need to be a part of the um, electoral reform discussions and whatnot. I suspect some of all you don't watch my videos because all you don't why be. <laughs> I in Australia, all you don't why be. Well, what I in Australia, I not you. <laughs> I not in Dominica. <laughs> Anyways, brothers and sisters, yo, <laughs> you miss it. You can be there at three p.m. Okay, early, just about three p.m. So I guess the match is almost over. So you guys are gonna be there for that one. Anyways, brothers and sisters, I'll be dropping two more. One on the Miss Lakes reaction channel, guys. Tune in for that a bit later on, as well as the uh. BRBPT reaction a bit later on as well. So definitely tune into this. The links, of course, will be the first comment in the comment box below. I'll see you guys in the next reaction video. Boom bang. <laughs>